Hello and welcome to my channel Shifa's Kitchen. Today I am going to show you how to make chicken tikka biryani. So let's start. For this here I have half a kg of chicken boneless. Then I have two medium sized potatoes fried. One fourth cup of cashews fried. I have one cup of curd or yogurt. Then I have five to six brown onions. I have puree of 5 to 6 tomatoes 2 tablespoons each of ginger garlic paste 1 tablespoon of chicken tikka shan masala then I have 3 green chilies split finely chopped green coriander for the spices I have 2 tablespoons of coriander powder 1 teaspoon of cumin powder 1 teaspoon of red chili powder and half a teaspoon of turmeric powder then I have red food color, I have salt to taste, half a teaspoon of garam masala, here I have 2 tablespoons of milk in which I have added yellow food color, I have 1 piece of coal, 1 tablespoon of desi ghee, I have brown onions for garnishing, here I have half a kg of rice which I have boiled in spices, cinnamon 1 in cinnamon stick, 1 bay leaf, C24 cardamom, C24 cloves, first we will marinate our chicken with chicken tikka masala then to this I will add red color to this I will add curd mix it if you like my video please give a thumbs up to comment and share subscribe to my channel hit the bell icon to get notified whenever I upload a new video then to this I will add a bit of salt keep a check on salt because the shan masala already contains the salt in it keep it to marinate for about 1 to 2 hours I have heated up the oil in the wok to this I will add ginger garlic paste mix it then to this I will add our marinated chicken mix it To this, I'll add coriander powder, turmeric powder, cumin powder, and red chili powder. Mix it. Then to this, we'll add our tomato puree. To this, I'll add green chilies and green coriander mix it and let it cook till the chicken is done now to this I'll add a brown onion mix it and we'll let it cook then to this I'll add
salt and garam masala powder mix it to this i add half of a cashews the rest i'll keep for garnishing Now to this I add fresh cream. Mix it. And your masala is done. Now I assemble our biryani. For assembling the biryani, in the bottom I will add a thin layer of rice. Make sure while boiling the rice, add one teaspoon of vinegar so your rice are separated. Add one teaspoon of oil too. The rice should be one third cooked. Now above it, I'll add our masala. Now. Over the masala, I'll add green coriander, finely chopped, and over it, I'll add a rice. Over the rice, I'll add a fried cashews. Then I'll place our fries. On the sides like this. Over it. I'll add. A food color which I have dissolved in milk. Here you can use the color of your choice. I'll sprinkle some fried onions. Then over it, I'll add some finely chopped green coriander. On the sides, I will add desi ghee. In the center, I'll place a bowl and then I'll smoke the biryani with the coal. I'll, pay, I'll place the coal over it. I'll add desi ghee, cover it with lid and let it cook for about 10 to 15 minutes on slow flame. Chicken tikka biryani is ready. Serve it with bundi raita. If you like my video, please give a thumbs up. Do comment and share. If you recreate any of my recipes, don't forget to tag me on any of my social media accounts, Facebook and Instagram.
subscribe to my channel hit the bell icon to get notified whenever i upload a new video thank you